first thing on the president's schedule after yesterday's swearing-in ceremony was the inaugural luncheon. And as Seth Doan reports, the wine with the meal came from a man who's having a very successful second career. From the New England lobster to the heirloom vegetables to the South Dakota bison to the wonderful New York wines, each element was carefully chosen and expertly prepared. One of the New York wines served at Monday's grand inaugural luncheon in Statuary Hall was from Michael Lynn's Bedell Cellars. Are you envisioning uh, President Obama kind of looking at the label and saying, ooh, I should uh, go to this place? I hope so. I, uh, <laughs> we'd love to see him here. It would be a thrill for us. Uh, that would be a remarkable thrill for us. Lynn has always been better known for thrilling moviegoers. The former head of New Line Cinema, he produced blockbusters, including the Lord of the Rings trilogy. One ring to rule them all. How did you get involved in, in the wine business? I got interested in the possibility of owning a vineyard. And the truth is, like I think with most people, the first thing I thought about was France, Italy, California. I really didn't think about Long Island. Until 13 years ago, when he settled on Bedell Cellars in Kutchog on the North Fork of Long Island, just two hours from his home base in New York City. Today, 25 full-time employees work this 80-acre artisanal vineyard to turn out about 10,000 cases of wine annually. Is there a pride in being in one of these emerging, lesser known markets? Yeah, it's like the underdog in the football game. You know, It's a little better when you beat the guy who's supposed to win the game. Its wines have scored up to 91 points from Wine Spectator, a rare feat for an East Coast vineyard. These are our barrels for the red wines that we're aging for 2012. Rich Olson Harbick is Bedell's master winemaker. He says their 2009 Merlot was the perfect complement to the bison served at the luncheon. It's something I think it really validates the region as a whole and our company in particular. Um, and uh, it shows that I think Long Island wines um, have a seat at the table. New York Senator Charles Schumer was a big reason Bedell was served. As chairman of the inaugural committee, he chose to feature New York wines. Until a couple of weeks ago, Bedell was better known for its artsy bottle labels, inspired by Michael Lynn's other passion, contemporary art. After Monday, it may be better known for another label, a wine fit for a president. For CBS This Morning, Seth Doan, Kutchog, New York. Congrats to Michael Lynn. Well, and Michael Lynn, exactly. Michael you think, Lynn, um, you think Seth had a taste? I think he might have had a little <laughs> pops. <laughs>